Oh my God! <laughs> you actually believe me? Look at you. What? Well, I wasn't being serious. I don't want to marry you. It's a joke. Oh, bless. Do you know what? That is really not funny. Well, I suppose it, it depends on your point of view, but your face, Pat, did you see it? Yeah. Do you know, for a horrible moment there, I actually thought that you might say yes. You'd have really been picking me up off the floor then. Oi, we said no more dares. No, 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 you said. And besides, you owed me, you still do. But don't worry, I will think of something much more enjoyable for us to do. Yeah. Well, how about you dare me to leave this pub and find someone less irritating to talk to, eh? Oh, Ryan! It was a joke! Ah, oh, typical man. He can dish it out, but he can't take it. So much for the honeymoon period. I'm sorry, he didn't say yes. Where's Peggy? Upstairs, why? It's private. Shirley! Can I just say one more time, for the hard of hearing, that I didn't want Ryan to say yes? You can say it. I didn't! It was a joke, okay? I don't want to marry him. I never have done. Don't you make this into something that it isn't, Pat. No wonder you're so unhappy. What? Same old Janine, pretending nothing matters when it does. <clears throat> well, safer that way, isn't it? Lonelier, too. There is nothing lonely about me. That is ridiculous. Okay. It's ridiculous. In fact, it's projection. That's what's going on. Because you really are the sad and lonely one, Pat, you know, not me. Fine. Seeing romance where it isn't. And as you're trying to make me feel bad when deep down inside, you know that you are the one that's unhappy. Come on, admit it. OK, I'll admit it if you just go. You really think I'm lonely? Watch me. I proposed. He actually proposed to you, seriously. Yeah. And then burst out laughing, said it was all a big joke, just wanted to freak me out. Oh, that's a bit mean. And a lie. She was serious, that's the thing, I saw it. And if I said yeah, straight away, then we'd be engaged right now. But then why didn't you? Don't be stupid. I'm not. Come on, I know you love her, because you've told me before. <sighs> Unless you were lying. OK, all right, I love her. And have you told her that? Come on, more times than she's told me. Well, what is it you're doing here? I mean, are you keeping count? She just asked you to marry her. Yeah, and then laughed in my face at the very idea of it. Like, she realised as soon as the words were out of her gob just how stupid it sounded. I don't know, maybe she was embarrassed that you didn't say yes. She... She didn't even give me enough time. But it's not something you think about. Like, if I asked Billy to marry me, he'd have to say yes with a massive smile on his face. Then I would know. If he didn't want me, it'd just be over, wouldn't it? It is over. He's not even returning your calls. Sorry, I didn't mean that. I'm sorry. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. Get off me! Hey, I do that, don't I? Lash out and say the wrong thing because I'm angry. At me? No, darling, at what you said. Because you're right. Maybe. A bit. Well, then go round there and tell her you want to marry her. What if I'm wrong? What? what if it was just a joke? Is she worth the risk? Didn't mean that about Billy. Of course he likes you. Everyone knows that. Ryan. Promise me you're going to find him again, will you? Is she worth the risk? I'm serious. I need to know that I haven't screwed that up. Is she worth the risk or not? I mean, it's a simple yes or no, right? And if you can't decide, then it's a no, ain't it? Well, then it's a no. Gotta be in it. Problem solved. Cheers, sis.